Dear students, this is Basaraj Mali, Associate Professor, Sheikh College of Engineering and Technology, Bilgaon. Today, in rate analysis, I am going to teach you regarding basics of how to calculate brick, cement and sand in a brick masonry. So, <clears throat> before starting, let's assume the quantity of brickwork. In the quantity of brickwork, the volume of brickwork we shall take as 1 meter cube. All calculation will do in 1 meter cube. Then grade of cement mortar is 1 is to 6. That is 1 part of cement is to 6 part of fine aggregate. That is sand. Then brick size, first class bricks of 19 centimeter by 9 centimeter by 9 centimeter. This is 19, 9, 9. So, <coughs> this is with mortar. So, basic brick size is 19 centimeter by 9 centimeter by 9 centimeter. Mortar thickness is 1 centimeter. So, there are 5 steps to calculate the materials in this 1 meter cube of brickwork. First step is number of bricks required with mortar. We have to calculate the number of bricks required with mortar. The calculations will be for 1 meter cube. So each brick is of size 20 centimeter with mortar that is 19 plus 1 centimeter then 10 centimeter on the width then height is 10 centimeter that is 9 centimeter plus 1 centimeter so in 1 meter cube of brickwork you divide it the size of this brick i have converted this into meters now so 1 meter cube by 0.2 meter into 0.1 meter into 0.1 meter that is equal to 500 bricks so 1 meter cube of the brickwork contains 500 bricks. This is with mortar. Then second step, that step B, wet quantity of mortar required. That is when the 1 meter cube of brickwork is taken, we have already that cement mortar will be of a wet quantity that is after adding water after adding water so 1 meter cube of brickwork minus the brick quantity that is 500 bricks into volume of one brick volume of one brick is 0.19 meter by 0.9 centimeter that is 0 0.09 meter and 0 0.09 meter that is 1 minus 0 0.07695 that is equal to 0 0.23 meter cube. So after removing the quantity of bricks, you need mortar quantity of 0 0.23 meter cube. Now step 3 that is C, dry quantity of mortar. You know we have calculated, calculated wet quantity of mortar. Now dry quantity of mortar required that is before adding that is standard it is a fixed standard it is calculated in the lab so dry quantity is required is 1.54 times the wet quantity that is 1.54 into this wet quantity you will get 0 0.35 meter cube so this is the dry quantity of mortar required so in mortar there are two components one is cement and another is sand so cement in the ratio 1 is to 6 so 0 0.35 is the dry quantity required then the ratio is 1 is to 6 so 1 plus 6 we have to divide dry quantity divided by the ratio 0 0.35 divided by 7 it gives 0 0.05 meter cube so this is the quantity of cement required 0 0.05 meter cube so what is this 0 0.05 meter cube <coughs> if you convert into bags 
usually we have to calculate on the site in terms of bags so number of bags of cement that is equal to 0 0.05 into density of a cement it is a standard density of cement it is 144 kg per meter cube divided by the quantity of cement in one bag that is it is 50 kg so 1440 divided by 50 kg you will get 1.44 bags so uh, even you can write it in meter cube but sometimes you can even calculate in terms of bags that is 1.44 bags so the cement required is 1.44 bag next sand sand is of course we know in the ratio 1 is to 6 6 times of cement we require that is 6 into 0 0.05 meter cube that is 0.3 meter cube so 0.3 meter cube of sand is required i hope you understood the concept of the calculation of the quantities in a brickwork thank you